let's talk a little bit about our weather right now. And uh, it's still going to be cold out there, but you'll still need your sunglasses, I would imagine. Yeah, you know, and winter is also right around the corner. Our Coin6 weather team took a dive into what El Nino might mean for the region. One excessive snowstorm. Bone chilling cold. Just a snapshot of what Portland had to endure last winter. Portland saw a grand total of 11 inches of snow last season. That's when La Nina was in place. El Nino conditions are already starting to build, and that can make winter a lot different for us this year. Let's first start off with explaining what El Nino is and the impacts it has for us here in the Pacific Northwest. Warmer Pacific Ocean waters help drive the jet stream farther to the south, keeping the Pacific Northwest drier and potentially warmer while the southern U.S. will experience more storm activity. It's that combination that could reduce Portland's snow chances overall. El Nino winters historically bring less snowfall to the Portland area. But the last El Nino back in 2018 and 2019 brought above normal snowfall to Portland. That's why these predictions are so difficult. Each year varies so much. So the past climate trends typically puts Portland with a drier and potentially warmer winter ahead. But even with this prediction, you could have one outlying snowy and cold weather event. That's why we're predicting maybe zero to one inch of snowfall all season long here in Portland. But the true test to this forecast is time. So right now, prepare for the snowiest of winters, but expect a mild one ahead. Okay, so that's, you know, I think some good news for anyone who's hoping not to have to shovel the driveway again this year. Oh, so yeah. the odds oh. are for a low snow winter doesn't uh -huh. mean that's what we'll get. Okay. So just want to put that caveat in there. What does that mean in terms of ice? Because that's always a big issue here as much as anything is yeah, the ice I, side of it. You know, I think in general, uh, we are tending to see more of an icy mix in our winter weather mm -hmm. here in the winter time. And it really depends on where the Arctic air mass comes in. The gorge is a really good channel cold air, which is how we kind of get um, the colder weather here and snow in the city. So mm. it's where that line of cold and warm meets. Yeah. It can be hard to predict this far out, but yeah, ice storms certainly uh, possible too as we head towards this winter. Gotcha. We'll see what we get. All right. Yeah, it might okay. feel like it out there right now. I in know. Terms of getting some 